Hello everybody, my name is Belicht and welcome to Escape the Horde. We're playing on 1000 EXP multiplier, but our loot abundancy is only 25%. What that means is that basically our character is going to be leveling up quite fast, but the game stage is also going to go up super fast. And probably in like 7 days, in within like 1 week, the uh, game stage goes up so fast that we might start uh, getting some endgame zombies including uh, demolishers and we are getting blood moon every two days and our main objective is try and find enough wicked book craft the workbench and uh, craft the 4x4 and escape this place before <laughs> before it's too late man uh, with the 25% loot abundancy it might be a little bit challenging for us to find some loot. Let me explain the settings for this series while I do this initial challenge. We're playing on warrior difficulty and hoard this every two day. The zombies are jogging during the day but the blood moon zombies have a nightmare speed. And uh, we are gonna be doing whatever it takes to actually survive the zombie horde nights because uh, in a few days it's gonna get hectic and uh, you know we gotta just try to survive this challenge man let's craft our primitive clothes and uh, hood shoes and everything i gave myself the helmet light mod it's gonna make things easier to see and uh, this challenge is permanent death series so if i die then it's over man let's uh, redeem everything i'm thinking of just going uh big boy here and uh, go for boomstick and skull crusher so that's what I'm thinking. So let us put a few points here and one point, one more point into Skull Crusher. Craft ourselves the Stone Sledgehammer. All right, let's go into this initial POI and clear the zombos here and loot this place. Hello, who's there? You guys are upstairs or what? Hello. All right, there's some toilet. Nothing there. Um, yeah, we gotta move quite fast. 25% loot abundancy. There's not not much to be looted, actually. Let's grab this uh, chair. Free resource. God damn it, where the hell is that zombie? Upstairs. Uh, we'll go up. We'll go upstairs. God damn it, I'm... I'm having some goosebumps. Shit. Let's let's deal with this. Hey! Ooh, this is a rabbit right here. Oh, we got the rabbit. And there's the zombie. 400,000 DXP. <laughs> God damn it, man. Alright, let's uh, grab this rabbit. Let's craft the bone knife. Let's grab all these. Okay, let's go, man. Uh, murky water. Nope. I wonder if we can find murky water at all. That is going to be a question. Hello. I don't think this POI has a main stash. But uh, it's uh, worth checking. Hello. Anybody? Nope. Some language. Empty. Alright, let's, let's go, man. Let's go to the trader. So our plan for... This episode is uh, try and find a PY suitable to make a shelter and uh, hopefully it's going to be good to make a, you know decent to make a horde base uh, because the horde night is every 2 days I don't think we have time to you know build our own horde base but uh, we can utilize already existing PY and turn it into horde base with the minimal amount of materials morning bow good day with the changes to the Horde Knight with the full release, no matter what the difficulty is, what the game stage is, the Horde is gonna continue throughout the night, so it is best of our interest to find a PY that can with withstand Horde every night for every two days until we make ourselves a decent base, man. Now that you did the job, I guess you ain't that damn bad after all. Of course, man, I'm not bad at all. All right, let's get this initial job. We gotta move quite quickly. We can loot the workstations later. Let's just do this job first. Oh, Dick Steiner! 
Man, that's a good POI to uh, make home as well as some whole heart base. It's made out of concrete. Hmm. There we go. There's the bird supplies. Murky water. I'll take that. Hey, man. Alza. I wonder if we are gonna be getting anything from the back. Oh! <laughs> Holy crap, we just leveled up three skill points to spend. Uh, let's check out this bag. Stone sledgehammer. I will gladly take that. Hell yeah, man. Level two. And that's about it. Let's put one point into boomstick and increase our agility. I do want to get the two meter jump as well. Yeah. Wrecked, I'm back. Damn, you smell like the dead. Yep. So I am gonna be playing shotgun. However, is a pipe shotgun good choice? I'm just gonna take it, man. Whatever. All right, let's. Uh, there's a two fetch job which is nearby. Very supply. I'm not gonna do very supply. The other two fetch job is kind of far away. Bobcat's bar. Let's do that. Myself. I'll cut your goddamn throat. Rest assured, my man. I am not gonna F this up. Let's uh, craft some more stone arrows. There you go. Now, when we are fighting the horde in this series, we are allowed to do anything, man. We can run away from the horde, hide from the horde, fight the horde, or even make a base, build a base that is broken to deal with the horde whatever it takes man all right this is the uh, bobcat poi this is actually you know the poi that we made ourselves a home when we were playing the loot dependency zero challenge and there is actually the satchel job is done but let's loot this this should have one uh oh where the heck did you come from lady this should have uh Cooking pot, which is gonna be helpful. Hey man, good day. Who's there? Jim Binky, dead. Oh my god, one shot it. Uh, toilet is gonna be empty. I think, I don't think we can find uh, murky water from the toilets. Uh, let's grab the chair and the pot. Uh, there's ATM machine right here. We can come back. Uh, let's try to find some stuff here if we can. Hey, Maggie. Oh. Holy shit, man. It's been a long time since I played the sledgehammer and I forgot how powerful it is. We just gotta watch out our stamina, man. Cash register, few duke. Shelf, a piece of cloth, I won't sake. That's about it. Let's go. So the pot should be right there, if I remember correctly, along with the zombie. It could be Mo. Alright, let's grab all this loot. I'll take that. Coffee. A piece of coffee, I will sake. Stove. Yep. Hello. Uh, I knew it, Mo. You are always freaking here, and there is the pot. Leveled up again. Let's put that point into agility and one point into parkour. The next time we'll level up, we can grab the two meter jump. Let's grab the pot. Any drinks here? Nothing. Um, are we gonna be able to find food here? Nope. So the 25% loot abundance is not as bad with the loot abundance is zero. But it is still gonna be a little bit challenging, man. Hello, zombos. Yup. I know you guys are here. Team Pinky. Sleeping tight. He is dead. Businessman. Dead. Hello. Oh. What the heck? Bird. Holy shit. Where the hell did you come from, lady? You just leveled up. 
put that point into stuntman there we go now we can start spending the points into strength All right, <laughs> that zombie was burning. Here we have the main stash. What do we have? Oh, how about still that great find pipe rifle with some 762s, Fortitude mod. I mean, this town is uh, actually not that big. We might need to probably move towns, but I think we can set up our home here or the Dick Steiner. Uh, we might we might do it at the Dick Steiner. Shamway food crate here. Cooking book. I'll take that and more food. Actually, uh, let us leave most of this stuff here. And we can come back and uh, get our loot later. I'm back. Sharp sticks. Nine mils or pipe bomb. I am going to take the pipe bomb, man. It might come in handy. Nine mils is nice, but... Oh, pipe bomb. Clear zombies. Like Pass and gas Looks store like eight. What is this? Dick Steiner. Okay. All right. Perfect. So let us do this uh, Dick Steiner, and uh, let's set up our home there. Man, Dick Steiner is a great place. Uh, we just leveled up. Uh, just to start finding some more Forge Head books. Let it. Let us put one point into lock picking, and I do want to put some point into the grease monkey as well. So let us put one point into intellect and then we can put one point into grease monkey. We're feeling quite hungry and thirsty. Let's go up to our loot. Eat the hobo stew. There we go. This should cover us for today. And there's the dick diner. Let's go there. God damn this uh, sledge. Can't wait to find a better sledge, man. All right, let's start this job. This Dick Steiner is also quite easy to clear. Hey. Hello. There should be a zombie right there. Let's sneak that guy dead and deal with this guy. Not dead, almost dead. And there should be Steve Yo. Oh, he woke up. Hey, Steve Yo. that just leveled up <laughs> man this is what we're talking about let's put the point into grease monkey i mean yeah man like our character is gonna be leveling up but the game stage is gonna go up so fast what is our game stage now 12 <laughs> all right there's a purse here let's loot this trash nothing Hello, Zombo. Yep, lady, lady in the red. Dead. Let's search the toilet. Nothing. Let's uh, use our helmet light mod. The uh, supply is actually up on top of the roof, I think. Trash. Bone. I will take. Let's close this door for a bit. Hey, we're closed, Mo. Go somewhere else. Uh, coffee machine empty, and there should be another zombo right here. Hello. Where are you? Inside the toilet? Yep. Oh, <laughs> are you dead? <laughs> now he is. Man, this sledgehammer is quite satisfying. Man. Don't uh, let's let's deal with this mo. He is about to destroy my door. Hey, let's also grab all this chair. Free resource. Boom! Oh God, man, I just freaked up your legs. What the heck just happened with your legs, man? That. All right, let's get inside. Close this door and. Here should be two zombies. One zombie is right behind that, and one zombie may be up either of these. Yeah. Nope, I was wrong. But zombos are here. Two zombies. Hey! Holy crap, man. 
Oh. Dead. All right, this POI should be clear. Ooh, there's some food. Man, this is rest assuring. I mean, uh, the food piles are not 100% empty. We can still find some stuff. What do we have? Uh, shotgun is uh, yeah, shotgun has shotguns have 20% less degradation. I'll take that. Some bandage, great. Medical supplies, paper. That's a very good medical supply. Let's uh, get this passing gas crate. Vehicle book right away. Nah. Now scrap the shovel. Off-road schematics. Let's just read it. And uh, wheel. I'll take that. One wheel. Good. Coffee machine. I mean, we can probably loot this later. Uh, let's... Where the hell is the supplies? Are you telling me the supply is actually on top of the roof? Can we make this jump? Oh, yep. Oh, there's a medical supply right here. Hey, honey, and the medical book. That is good. Oh, bird. Man, the uh, supplies is not on top of here. Oh, what the heck? The supplies is here. There we go. There's the supplies. Let's get that. And uh, let's craft the land claim block, which we need a little bit stone. Place our land claim block right there. And let's actually leave all this loot in our storage and let's get back it is uh, 6 p.m i think we can actually do one more job before we call it a day i do want to grab some try to grab some more stone and clay to make some cobblestone for the horde base for tomorrow uh, probably we end up doing something with the dick steiner i i don't want to overcomplicate things God damn it, wrecked. What the heck do you have in your, uh, around here? What the heck do you have? Why am I allergy is happening? I am going to get the crafting skill magazine bundle. Yes. Passing gas. I'll do that. Let's open this box. Oh, there we go. Vehicle book, armored up book, medical book. Great. Oh, there's a working stiff tool car right there. And dog house. Uh... Dog, I know there's a dog, there's gonna be a dog right here, somewhere. I do wanna loot that uh, work stiff tool car though. I mean, we can jump two meter high. We don't need to afraid of some dogs. We can just jump on this kind of fences. Oh, oh my God, there was more right there. Oh, good day, Mo. Dead. All right. Oh, there is the dog. You are blending in with the environment quite good. Oh, shit. Oh, dog. Jump back. Hello, dog. I can hit like this. Boom. I'm Clark. that um i am actually gonna scrap the cement we don't need the cement as for now here is the passing gas let's just start the job i don't think we can do this in time i mean finish it and turn back in the job maybe maybe not dead holy crap man this Bitch hammer is nice. Alright, let's loot around some pipe. I will take what else we have. Nothing. Uh, some lead, I will take. Cooler. Nothing there. I need some drinks. One piece of murky water. Man, I'm gladly gonna take this man with the 25% loot abundancy. The drink is gonna be in... Uh, 
uh, quite an issue. Another dog. Uh, just a little bit high up. The dog is not dead. Come here. Dead. Hello? Anybody? Let's go up here. There's one passing gas crate right there. And there we go. Man, we have already at the 4 out of 100. There should be a few stevios right here. There we go. Let's just drop down. Oh, holy shit. God damn it. What? what, what? I'm stuck. Job is done. We just leveled up 5 points to spend. Uh, am I should I be happy about this? Big and fast, yep. Uh, skull crusher. I do want to put one point there as well. I think we should put one point into Master Chef because we are playing. I mean, we gotta not forget that we are playing on 25% loot abundancy. It's not, it's not gonna be easy to find food and drinks. Grab that, get the gas. There's the main stash. Level 2 bow. I'll take that. What do we have? How to harvest coffins for jewelry and precious gems. That's good. I'll take some shotgun shells. 762s. Workbench. I'll grab all those. Wrecked. Don't close. I'm coming. Erect. I am back. Holy shit. I thought you were a zombie. Oh, <laughs> Wait, here you go. No, man. This is a quite a tough choice. I'm gonna get the grilled meat, man. I know what it, how it feels like to play on uh, low loot abundancy. Food and drink is gonna be an issue, so I'll take that. And uh, let's grab another job. Fetch job is f like that's so far away, man. The river residence. I mean. We probably end up not doing the job. Yeah, let's not do that. Tomorrow it's day two and it's gonna be the whole horde night. So we should probably uh, build our horde base tomorrow and uh, loot the POIs around our home and not go too far away. I think that's the smart thing to do, man. All right, let's get back home. I actually want to grab my loot from the bobcats. Drink some water because we are quite thirsty. I should have sold a few stuff. But it's fine. Let's get back. We are encumbered, I know. But our home is right there. All right, it is in the morning. Last night I did not do much because I wanted to preserve my energy. Uh, my food is looking all right. Let's eat like one. Yeah, one meat should be enough. Yeah, let's save the rest. All right, today let's uh, build our horde base. We are going to be fighting the horde. Um, how am I going to do this? Oh, no, I didn't mean to fall down. Let's get inside. I mean, uh, we can probably, you know, fight the horde like here at the entrance because this miss this is made out of concrete and this is actually bulletproof, ca uh, you know, windows. So we can actually we can probably fight the horde here, but I don't want that kind of a you know short-term solution. Probably we will end up uh, fighting the horde here uh, multiple times. Man, look at this. Our game stage is already 20. Man, it's gonna be crazy, man. Yeah, I mean, uh, we can make some sort of platform here. And, you know, we're just gonna make good old uh, regular pole walk base. But uh, with the uh, sledgehammer, I actually want to double down, you know, try and double down the pole walk so that we can hit two targets at one time. And see how that works, man. Okay, first things first. Let us go ahead and grab some stone from there. And also get some clay. And uh, mix some cobblestone. 
And right off the bat, we are going to be making our base with cobblestone. Which should be good, man. We do have one point. Let's put that point into minor 69er. Hold on a second. Do we have a... Hey, we have a bunch of challenges completed. How many levels did we just get? Two point. Um, that's good. Put that here and put that there. Another point, actually. Minor 69er. There we go. This is going to help us with the stamina. Hopefully our stamina is not going to go down. Oh, barely, man. Look at that. Great. We can mine non-stop. Huh. Maybe we should, like, uh, grab as much stone as possible right now. And then uh, go to Wrecked and try to do some bird supply job. After all, that doesn't sound too bad because we need some clay as well. And bird supply jobs do have some food and uh, drinks. Alright, 1600 stone. Uh, that should be fine for now. Morning wrecked. There we go, bird supply. This is the nearest. I'll do this. Let's sell these. Um, I haven't checked his inventory. Let's see what... He is selling. Oh my god! Wrench and the pickaxe? Holy crap, man. This is what we need to buy, although we don't really have much coin. Probably we can buy. I think we should get the wrench, right? I mean, iron pickaxe is great, but probably we need to buy the wrench. Probably we can buy it tomorrow. And I'm saying probably a lot, but. <laughs> okay, get hammered, book, some ammos, dye, spoiled meat, water. What the heck? Cement mixer and workbench. These are, I'm never going to be able to buy them. The inventory is going to get restocked at day four. I don't think I can make enough money to buy it. Wooden bow. And you are selling good stuff. Don't let the door hit you on your way out. Yeah, man. Um, Yaka smoothie is also looking tempting. Actually, let's buy one Yaka smoothie, man. Let's drink this. Uh, we don't have much drinks at home. Oh my god, Nevis Gains falls right there. I died in this BOI before. In the loot abundance is zero series. And this uh, POI is a very good POI. It's tier 3 POI. But uh, this is uh, like a small POI. So the zombies are like packed inside. There's a bunch of zombies. And you have to fight all of them at once. And not to mention that there's like one white in there. I mean, we do have pipe bomb, right? We can probably break the uh, white. All right, here we are. Let's start the job. It's going to take a while, but let's do this. Oh my god, there's the uh, food. Let's uh, grab this. I see a decent food. Hey, everybody. Good morning. Good foggy morning. Let's actually put the trap right there and deal with the zombies because I do want to get some more clay and craft some cobblestone that anybody else I thought so all right half with sandwich I will take that and uh, let's uh, grab some more clay and craft some more cobblestone as well Hey, wait a second. Wait, oh, wait a second. Good morning, Jim Binky. Another bird supply job. How about we get that job and do that? We are going to be getting some goodies. Look at this. Almost stew, can of sham, pure mineral water. This is super good, man. Hey, right, I'm back. I want to get the pipe pump, but I also want to get the food. I mean... If we are not worrying about our food, it's going to be great, especially early on. Uh, 31 food, 20 water. 
we do have hobo still i'm gonna get the pipe bomb man we do have hobo still so it's all right and we do have next time bathe before coming to a job interview man what the heck where is time to bathe i have a horde to deal with tonight gotta build my horde base as soon as possible got that it was a bit of overkill but food is everything man food is everything morning mo not today not today come back tonight when i am gonna be fighting the horde is that a burnt biome or wasteland over there? Oh, there you go. There's the burst supplies. Grab that. That was decent loot. Hello. Hey, morning. Oh, dead. Man, this uh, stone sledgehammer actually feels a bit satisfying. Because it's lighter, it I do hit a little bit faster. As compared to the, you know, the iron sledgehammer the, or the steel sledgehammer. Okay, let's uh, craft some more cobblestone. Yeah, this should be enough, right? Yeah, this is gonna be more than enough. Alright, let's get back and turn in the job. And probably... Uh, finish our horde base and then if we have some time we could try and loot around our neighborhood if not then uh, let's just fight the horde man i'm back greg learning how to jump and land quietly collecting urban combat books are always good vitamin is not that much automatic handbook 6762s i am going to get this man it's gonna help us hunting and stuff, so let's do that. This is the nearest job, Motel 7. I will take this job. Since we are here, let us loot the wrecked place and see what we can find. Especially, let's loot the workstations. There we go, King Station. Mm, Carmel, I guess I'll take. Uh, nothing here. There's a cement mixer. Unfortunately, no... Forge head books. I mean, in normal circumstances, we are guaranteed to find the forge head books from the cement mixer, but in our case, I guess that's not the case. Food? Nah. We should find one forge head book from here. Oh my god, this is not looking good, man. I thought with the 25% loot abundance, we would be able to find some books from the forge. Cement mixer, not so much, but I thought this was guaranteed, but I guess that's not the case. Hmm. Alright, this is gonna be the main platform that we are gonna be standing. Yeah, I'm gonna run two poles. Oh my god, man, our base is so high up. I don't really need to make the pole too long. Holy crap, man, look at this. That's a huge ass stair. Let's upgrade this. Yeah, man, this is looking all right. I mean, there's no zombies will be coming here. They can drop down. Oh, god damn it. And they are gonna spray in their leg like that. But the idea is that, you know, the zombies are gonna be coming up from the both direction. I should build these stairs to the other side as well. And we are gonna be fighting zombies right here. And because we are using the sledgehammer, hopefully we can hit the both of the zombies bunched up here. I don't think I have enough cobblestone to actually build this stair right here. Let's try, man. Do we level up? Yes, we did. Let's actually put that point into model load. Let's eat something and finish our base. It's almost 6 p.m. Getting close, man, getting close. Man, it was a good thing that we got the grilled meat. I wonder if we are gonna be getting the spider zombies right away. 
Man, those spider zombies could be problematic. They could jump from here to there or something. We gotta block these off. I mean, at least with some uh, building blocks, at least. No! The consequences of rushing things. There we go, our horde base is almost done. I mean, I think it's done, it is done. We just gotta build something around the platform that we are standing. Clint. What do I need? Cloth fragment, duct tape, and wood. I mean, I don't have cloth fragments, man. Let's try to find some cotton plants. We do have one piece of glue. With that glue, we can craft a, a duct tape. I see a cotton plant right there. Only one. Oh, there we go. There is some cotton plants. Time is running out, man. Craft some more cloth fragment, cancel that. Duct tape, there we go. With that, let's craft flint. It was a waste of resource, but whatever. Our horde base, check. We have a little bit of cobblestone to repair stuff, check. And we have our weapons, full HP to repair some stone with, check. Our current game stage is at 31. After this horde, how much is it's gonna be? Man, it is actually going up faster than I expected. All right, horde is starting. Escape the horde series, very first horde. Let's go, man. Oh, that's a loot bag right there. Oh my God, one shotting them. Good. Holy shit. Great. Our stamina is looking not that great as well let's actually eat our battle meal and drink this water to have our stamina up there we go now i'm ready get down piece of craps they are kind of choosing the path to the right hopefully they choose the other path yep there we go and they line up so that i can double hit them this is actually Working as intended, man. Great. Hey, another loot bag. Great. Give me some more loot bags. I need those. Three skill points. Oh my god, that hit hard. That, that hit hard. God damn it, can't even speak. Uh, let us put those point into... One point into... Strength and Skull Crusher level 4. This is gonna help with the stamina a little bit. So far, the horde base is working immaculate. Perfect. Oh! <laughs> god damn it. Except the broken leg, which is healing. Oh god. I wonder if there's gonna be a feral zombie right off the bat. Another loot back. Great. Man, we are almost kind of reliably one-shotting the zombies which is good but uh, our fun is gonna end very soon man once we start getting those feral zombies radio zombies hello and you know big boys and stuff i mean this space is not gonna hold too long man it looks a very overpowered base but when, when we start getting those big boys and everything, they're just gonna chew through this cobblestone block. Leveled up again. Five skill points to spend. Let's see our game stage. 39 already gained almost a dozen game stage. Uh, let's repair this. Hey, don't, don't, don't crawl in. That's gonna be bad. Holy shit! I didn't notice this. Half HP. Almost went bad. We still got ways to go. In terms of the horde. Maybe I should... 
Is this good idea now? Nah, it's not that great idea. It's kind of hard to hit the faces of tall zombies. But I don't want them to crawl inside. Let's keep repairing. They are doing quite a bit of amount of damage to the blocks. Another look back. Oh my god. Ouch. Man, why you guys hurt so much? Saving skill points to spend. Holy crap. Let's spend those. Uh, strength is almost maxed out. Just a tad bit more points remaining. Oh man, we are... Kind of like... One-shotting them. Oh! Holy shit, this is so satisfying. Oh, there goes the scaffold default. Oh man, yeah, this feels much better to hit the heads. Man, we can even like put some traps like this. To slow down the zombie. Though we are not going to be getting the EXP from the trap. And the wood traps are actually not that tough. man. <laughs> oh my god. Just leveled up. Put that point into strength. Our strength is maxed out. I, I think I should play a sledgehammer more often man. I mean, I know our skill is very high, but still, this is satisfying. Oh, another loot bag. Hey, it is in the morning. Challenge completed. Survive the blood moon. All right, come here, man. Let's go down and uh, finish off the zombies. Actually, we can just go like this. And that's a quite a bit amount of loot bags. Holy shit, get one-shotted by me. Man, look at this loot bag. Let's get all this. What do you have? Armored up book. Scrap that and get the rest. Holy crap, man. I thought this challenge was gonna be hard. Am I wrong? Let's see, man. Let's where. Let's see where this goes. Tech planet book. I'll just read that. Replace this. Probably we're gonna be getting some a lot of food here as well. Uh, we found some uh, raiders boots. I will check that out later. Let's loot more. Some nine mils. Bunch of supplies. Get a hammered book. Nice. Let's get. The rest, handy tool, some duct tape, perfect. Scrapping book, lamb ration, let's actually eat this food. Get that and eat this food as well. Uh, shotgun Mizaya, shotguns do 10% more damage. Perfect, I'll get that. Digest tool, yep, read that. Enforcer glows, some drinks, good. Bunch of duct tapes though. Let's just read the books, mining book. Take 50% less damage from collapsing. And there's another treasure map. Let's read this as well. Cause treasure. Forged book. Great. Armored up book. Scrap that. Get the rest. Shotgun book. Uh, scrap our shovel. Get this. Scavenger outfit. Shotgun book. And some drinks. This challenge seems... Uh, I thought it's gonna be harder, but... It seems easy. Or am I that good? Anyways, let's see where it goes, man. I'm gonna be ending the episode right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Have a great day. And peace. Nah, man. This challenge is not easy. Holy crap. What am I thinking? The zombies are gonna get really hard. And they are just gonna chew through this cobblestone. But we don't have concrete. What the hell am I thinking, man? It's just the first horde. Don't get your hopes too high up.